I'm called Barefoot Doctor because I'm essentially a humble healer, believe it or not. Um, the term Barefoot Doctor came from the ancient Orient and referred to people who wandered village to village, not literally barefoot, but in the humble state, not seeking glory or, or, or great wealth or anything from it, just keeping the local people in good spirits and in good health by offering them herbs and exercises to do, dietary advice, a little bit of acupuncture, teaching them a bit of Tai Chi and what have you. I was trained in Chinese medicine, qualified as a doctor of Chinese medicine actually back in 1983. Um, prior to that I was trained in psychotherapy and I've had a private practice in London for nearly 20 years. Um, most recently have um, stopped that in order to do projects exactly like this one, in other words to, to share the information with as many people as possible. My background is mostly based in, in, in the Orient Chinese medicine. But that doesn't mean that I'm closed-minded to other approaches. In fact, I think it's important that we keep ourselves as open as we can to all possible modalities of treatment. In other words, don't poo-poo it until you've tried it and see whether it works for you. Please consult your GP or registered practitioner before following any of the advice on this DVD. In this DVD, we're gonna to touch on treatments that are considered conventional uh, in Western terms, the ones that you'll be familiar with, as well as many complementary methods, some of which you'll know, such as acupuncture and massage reflexology, for example, and others of which you probably won't heard of that might even sound a bit far-fetched, but we're going to show you the, the possibilities that they might have to help you. Some of them are just going to be basic common sense, stuff that your grandmother would have told you. Uh, and, and in a way, those are the most useful because they're the ones that we will relate to the most.